championship fight. So it is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. And we are set for the start of round three. One thing a lot of fans don't know is that Kenny Florian actually impressed Dana White when he lost to Drew Fickett. And that loss, because he fought so hard in that fight, actually is what earned him his spot on the original Ultimate Fighter. Yeah, Drew Fickett had a wealth of experience coming into that fight. Many more fights than Kenny Florian had. And he was much larger than Kenny Florian. And um, he, Dana, went to see Drew Fickett. And in seeing Drew Fickett fight, he went to Kenny Florian after the fight and was like, listen, man, you're phenomenal, and would you like to be on the Ultimate Fighter? And brought him in, and the rest is history. Oh, landed a shot there. Oh, he's down. Controlling the head again. There's levels in jiu-jitsu, and BJ's is a notch above. It's a notch above most people in the world. Oh, reversal. Midway point of the fight. Oh, he's giving up his back. Joe, it looks like he's trying to set up a submission here. Good defense. Now able to posture up. This position right here is what many fighters have described as imposing your will on your opponent. He's going to look to pass. Just over a minute remains. And back to full guard. One minute remains, and they're going to stand him up. Here we go. 45 seconds remains. And you can get knocked out by one of those. Absolutely. He's got to be very cautious here. Stop. And they're going to stand him up. All right, they'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe once again. 15 seconds on the clock. Wow, Joe, really look, mixing it up. I love how he's changing levels here, Joe. What a great brawl here tonight. These guys are really battling each other.